proceed to our video, let me give you a brief description of what is a bad bat. A bad bat is washing someone who is in bed to prevent skin infection, promotes healthy skin, controls odor, and to increase the patient's comfort. Hello, good afternoon everyone. My name is Liberty Ascension and now I'm going to perform about bed batting. Bed batting. Ang bed batting ay nangahulugan sa pagliligo ng isang pasyente at makapulang sa kama at hindi maaaring na magkaroon ng physical or mental kakayahang maligo sa sarili. Ang pagliguan ng ay kilos ng paglilinis ng katawan ibinibigay ang mga paliguan para sa Kayang layunin ng therapeutic. Things that we need for bed batting. Toothbrush and toothpaste, cotton buds, mild soap, towels, comb, small basin, clothes, and bed sheet and pillowcase just in case the bed sheet get wet. General principles of bed batting. Keep the patient warm at all times. Position the linen, skip near the patient, and dispose of used linen immediately to reduce dispersal of microorganisms and dead skin cells into the environment. Only expose the area of the body being washed. Change water if it becomes dirty or cold and always after washing the genitalia and sacrum. Change wash clothes if they become soiled and after washing the genitalia and sacral area. Check skin for pressure damage. Avoid contaminating distressing and drains with water. Pat the skin dry to reduce the risk of friction damage. Separate skin folds and wash and pat them dry. Use correct manual handling procedures and equipment to avoid injury to yourself and to the patient. If the patient is unconscious, remember to talk them through what you're doing. Nurses should not talk over the patient. Good afternoon everyone, this is Christine from NCMA and today I'm gonna do a bed batting to a patient. But before I go to the procedure, I'm gonna do some information checking with the patient and introduce myself and do a proper hygiene. Let's assume that I already washed my hands with the seven steps of, of hand washing and now I'm going to introduce myself to the patient. Hello ma'am, can I know your name? I'm Lani. And your date of birth and age? Uh, September 2 and I'm 34 years old. Okay good, I'm Christine and I'm your caregiver for today. And now I'm doing a bed bath for you, is that okay with you ma'am? Yeah, it's okay. Okay, that's great. Before you do the procedure, you have to check the water if it's warm and if it's okay with the patient. These are the things that I need for the bed batting. The basin with warm water, the mild lotion, shower gel, toothbrush and toothpaste for oral hygiene, the face towel, the towel for drying, an extra blanket and extra clothes. So, so now I'm going to do the procedure. Before we do the procedure, we have to put at a 90 degrees angle. 
presentation. And make sure the patient feels comfortable. And we ask the patient whether the water in the basin is okay for the bed bathing. Ma'am, can you check the water if it's okay with you? Is it okay? It's okay. And now let's proceed to the bed batting. This is how you fold the face towel before the bed batting. And since the patient already tried the water and it's okay for her, let's proceed from washing the face down to the legs or feet. From the inner eye, go to the outer eye. Also, you can wash the patient from head down to the neck. Make sure to wash your towel in the warm water and the soap after every part of the body. And prepare your towel as you dry the patient. The bed has a hole on the side. Let's assume that after the side, I already washed the other side of my patient's body. And from head, going to the patient's legs and feet. Ngayon, babasahin natin ang towel para ipukunas. Okay. Ngayon, idarap natin sa kanyang mukha first. Ito ang gamitin, tapos sa likod naman, ito. Okay, pisahan na natin. So, pisahan ka natin. Tinabasa ulit ang towel. Para punasan ulit ang kanyang tawan. Yang 
saan natin dulo pa itaas. Ayan. Ganun din po sa kabila. niya pataas ang bansa kilikili Pisahan natin po sa kanilang place where bawunan natin sa baba tungo at taas. Ganun din sa papila.
low rinse or dry shampoo, water, and basins. And additionally, uh, second person and, and required for bed bathing just in case you need for the patient. First, now, I'm going to wear the gloves. So the patient now is unrest. First, I'm gonna do is to take the towel for her face. First, you're gonna do fold and do. Use the, the one you use the, to the right face, and then I turn my hand to that. And then you're gonna get another towel. Thank you. 